adding a spot color to a job. Press sign is designed to show CMYK colors by default, but you may have spot colors that you'd like to add to a job, or even if you're printing a multicolor job, you'd need to add the required additional colors. Here's how you do it. Firstly, go to the new job button. Once all of your standard settings are set up, you need to ensure that your press designation has enough units to add your spot colors. Here I'll show how to add just one spot color. So we see we've got black, cyan, magenta, yellow, and a fifth unit with no color in it. In press sign, we just click this unit icon up comes a window where we can now select the spot color number so long as you're just using a different number for each spot color. Then the spot color library drop down opens up and we can select from all of the pre-built Pantone libraries or we can add from a custom spot color that we've already created. I'm going to select the Pantone plus solid coated library and then I can simply type in a number of the spot color I'd like to use. If I show you the drop down, press sign will show you all of the colors that have the numbers that I've typed into that search dialog box. I'm going to use 338. I can now simply click OK. You'll see now that press sign has added that spot color to that unit. In order to monitor that spot color, we need to ensure that the color bar has a spot location. Here it is. If I now create the job, press sign will show us the sign magenta yellow and black plus the spot color designation and measuring the required color bar will give us data regarding all of those solid colors.